One of the misconceptions that we have is that histamine you know, intolerance comes from eating something and not being able to tolerate. The histamine that we actually ingest, it's 1,000 times less than the histamine we carry in the body. All the mast cells have histamine in the granules, and they release it constantly during the day because histamine is actually a good thing to have. Some people say, you know, with alcohol, I flush, and they have a mast cell activation disorder that we can diagnose. With hot and spicy foods, I flush. With uh, cured meats, I flush. With chocolate, I flush. That is real. That is real. All those things can activate mast cells one way or another. It's not what they contain, it's what they do to the mast cell. The mast cells have receptors that sense how spicy is your food, how hot is your food. They are the prime cells that we encounter in our mouth when we ingest, and they are able to sense all those things. And truly, some people cannot tolerate well alcohol, and, and some people cannot tolerate hot and spicy food, but it's not because that contains histamine. And so uh, there is not one size fits all. Let's put it that way. Some patients tell me when I go and fly and, uh, you know, just not sleeping enough hours, it's totally disruptive. I totally agree. That is also a, a big trigger for, for many people. Exercise, stress, emotions, you know, people become upset and that triggers mass cells too.